Hey guys, it's now Saturday. I think it's June 13th. So I reached into my freezer and I'm pulling out this tomato feta soup that I got from a food pantry a few weeks ago. Um, I'm going to be enjoying this for my lunch today. And I figured I'd show it to you guys and do a little uh, taste test on it. Mm. Okay, so I took it out of this. And I put it into a container and heated it up. It looks like it's nice and cooked thoroughly. Yep. So let's give it a try. Okay, trying it. Oh, it's good. Got little pieces of feta in it. Very little. It's still good. Mm. So it's slow simmered or slow simmered tomatoes. Finished with feta cheese and a touch of cream. It's really good. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Oh, I smell it. It smells really good. I really don't, I normally don't eat tomato soup. Although it's really good, I just never. Yep. Mm-hmm. This is really good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like it. That was a little hot. <laughs> I'm starving though. I had um Belveda Belveda biscuit breakfast bars for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Yep. So good. So this is all I've had since then. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is so good. Yummy, 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 yummy. Mm. So, the day before yesterday, I was taking a shower and um, almost lost my balance. I, you know, my, I always have a balance issue. And it got so bad to the point where I'm in the shower, I have a hard time keeping my balance. So I had to buy me one of these. I don't know if this is gonna be a permanent thing or temporary. I don't know yet, but um, it scared me enough to where um, I didn't want Lizzie to have to call 911. So this is my life right now. And it is embarrassing as shit, you know? I can only make it to a certain time of the day. And then I start feeling, I mean, I always feel off but it's to a certain time of the day where it gets worse 
especially being in front of a computer. It's not good, but I feel at any time of day, no matter what I'm doing, whether I'm out side or if I'm in my home, it affects me every day at any time of the day. I'm trying to get the weight loss journey back on track and but I'm so scared that something's going to happen to me. I'm trying to figure things out. It's just everything's going in the wrong direction. Monday I go for my MRI. Um and I'm having the MRI downloaded on to a uh, a DVD so I can take it to my ENT and my ENT said he's going to read it for free. So, um, and he's going to look at it ASAP. So I'll know on, hopefully I will know on Monday or Tuesday, um, what is what's going to happen next or even if there's going to be any type of diagnosis and go from there. You see guys, it's real. This is my um, request for the MRI. Yep, this is it. It's real. And it's scary as shit. You know, not knowing exactly what's causing this. Um, he doesn't think that my crystals are dislodged or whatnot. It's just really, really scary. I'm dealing with it so all right guys I have to I have to try and get back to work I'm looking at these screens and I can I just feel myself moving and it's just not cool um in a little bit I'm gonna show you guys exactly um what one of my major problems is and the whole reason why there is a need for a shower chair right now so i'm gonna demonstrate it in a little bit so you guys can see what's going on so all right guys i will talk to you guys or show you guys in a little bit Okay, so I got a stain on my shirt. So this is what the doctor was seeing when he was um, doing tests on me. So here, let me do it like this. Okay, um, I may have to. Sorry, my shirt's dirty and I'm not changing my shirt right now. So that's from lunch earlier, so. Okay, um, I may need to, um, put it back this way, I guess. So when you're checked for things like vertigo, they make you hold your arms out like this, and they 
I uh, first they try with your eyes open, you know, which I'm better at. Um, but when I close my eyes, it's a different story, as you can see. So, see that? And yeah, <laughs> it's not fun, <laughs> but that's what I'm living with. <laughs> so, um, and that is what they are trying to figure out what is causing it. Um, And hopefully I have um, some news soon um, what's causing it and how it's going to get treated. I joined a support group on Facebook for vertigo and other uh, related diseases like that or diseases that bring on vertigo. So... Um, A lot of people are telling me different things and I'm trying not to uh, read too much into them right now but um, feeling my balance off when I'm standing even with my eyes open um, not looking at a computer looking at a tree Trying to be out in public, you know, in a grocery store and standing and feeling myself go off balance. It doesn't look too promising right now. Um, and I have been told, I've read that I can still exercise, you know. Um, I just have to... Um, uh, figure out what exercises I can do. Um, within my limits. I know I can walk. I know I can do it. I just might need to, um, I might need to slow it down. Um, I don't know. Um, but I really miss taking my walks. I miss exercising. And I just want to get back to, uh, that again, um, I've been told too that some people have had to change their diet and stuff. So, I also, you know, it brings on a lot of anxiety for me, you know, and I've been diagnosed with an anxiety disorder. And, um,. I also feel like my heart is going to come out of my chest, you know? I hate it. I just hate this whole thing. Um, yeah, so, but that's, that's it right now. And I'm trying to drink more water. Trying to get back to drinking my water and I'm trying. Alright guys, so I just wanted to doc document that with you guys. I'm gonna uh, call it a day. I have to finish or try and finish work and then I have to door dash and make some money because I'm short on bills so I will update you guys again Monday because I am going to I'm going to document my um
MRI on Monday. I'm going to document my experience with it. I have to fast because I'm going to be getting a nice little IV in my arm because they want contrast so they can make my brain all f***ed up. <laughs> so, yeah. So, um, oh, and I think, I think I'm going to get my hair cut on Sunday. So, maybe Monday you will see a new cut. So, yeah, I'm trying to make my life as simple as possible right now. And that includes cutting my hair. So, all right, guys. Like what you see, you know what to do. Hit the like, subscribe, share, comment. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. I'll talk to you guys on Monday. Okay? All right. I love you. Bye.